Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing today? Today I am up in my office and I am trying to sort through this huge mess. I'm up in, like I said, I'm up in my office, not, you know, just trying to sort through what I'm going to be taking on my uh, road trip, uh, leaving Saturday, I believe. So it'll be a van home-to-home uh, -home trip, so it's not that big of a deal. And then, of course, down here, uh, I'm trying to figure out what bag I'm going to take. Uh, not sure yet. Uh, brief description. This one here is a, made by Smith. This company, uh, which is in Burlington, New Jersey, makes EMT bags. But he also delved into camera bags many years ago, let's say 20 years ago. So every now and then I'll reach out to him and he's clearing these out. He doesn't make them anymore, but it's a pretty cool little bag. You know, uh, it holds plenty of stuff. Uh, it's not going to hold the laptop or anything, but they're very well padded. Nice, uh, nice, uh, you know, nice construction. And the guy usually, you know, cuts me a deal. So I think I got, I usually buy them as gifts as well. So I bought this one here. And he threw this little one in for nothing because he's trying to clear them out. I don't know if he has any left. When I was there, we went into his basement of all places and we rooted through a pallet of, uh, of stuff that he had. So I'm not sure if he has any left, but you can see, I mean, if you carry a little X system, an X100, an XT series camera, you can put the camera body in there, a couple lenses. Uh, it's got plenty of outside pockets. It's got the, uh, the, the, the clasp, you know, uh, the little thingies here, you know, so it's not too bad. It's got nice outside pockets. This is a little bigger, uh, very, very well padded, even in, even in the back part of it is here. It's got the Velcro and, and uh, it's got the Velcro and these clips as well. And it's made by Smith here in New Jersey, uh, South Jersey. So that they uh, work pretty well um, haven't used this in some time but they're here uh, this is my low pro very inexpensive little bag beautiful little bag I keep this one in the van at all times because you know if I'm want to be walking around for some reason I can throw in a body or if I carry the body around me I can throw in a couple lenses some batteries it's got zipper compartments everywhere it's just pretty slick little little uh little bag here uh great compartments zippered uh very i mean it weighs nothing it is it weighs nothing it's got some pretty decent padding i mean i wouldn't go throwing it around but it's not too bad so that's that uh this is a think tank i don't know what model this i wish i did it's got the sound silencers so you don't wake the dead when you tear it open uh, it's got you know, you can configure this any way you want, obviously. It's got a place here for a laptop, as you can see. Uh, in here, turn that up. You can put a laptop or an iPad or whatever you want in there. Uh, multiple lenses. And my conflagration mess of <laughs> different uh, uh, material that I can use amongst any of my bags here. So, you know, you can see that I, I, I keep these handy. Um, anyway, this is another insert, which I normally use. Let's see which bag gets this insert. I can only remember. Uh, but one of my bags, uh, I shoved this in there. Um, and, you know, again, you know, hold a couple lenses if I want to use a bag that, that's kind of floppy. Uh, that's that. This is a, what is this? Uh, another low pro bag. Don't know where I got this puppy. This is the low, this is the Streamline 250, very small, very compact. Uh, carry a laptop, a small laptop, maybe a MacBook. Uh, my MacBook Air fits in here, my 11 inch MacBook Air. Um, an iPad, um, some accessories. It's got zippered compartments here, very nice. Couple divide, you know, it's divided into two here. Uh, it's also got this little bag here for your phone or whatever you want. And it has a zipper so that it can actually expand uh, two, three inches to make it, you know, uh, wider and, and fit more stuff, which is pretty cool. 
So, you know, it's it's not a bad bag. I haven't used this in quite a while, actually. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll play around with this one. Okay, that one's aside. Uh, this one. This one here, there is... I got my own insert in here, but this bag here has zero, zero padding. Nothing. I think I got this at the Salvation Army? I don't remember. Uh, but it's got huge amount of pockets, beautifully, uh, really comfortable little bag to throw over your shoulder and take somewhere. But yeah, I don't really use it as much as I, as I used to. But you need to put an insert in there, folks, because there is literally zero padding in there. All right. That's that. This is my daily bag. This is my Manfrotto bag here. Uh, forget what brand this is. Oh, it says M Guard. I don't know. It doesn't give me a number as always. Uh, again, I got the dividers that I can set it up any way I want. And you know, it's pretty nice. Uh, this is my XH1. I was shooting some baseball the other day, so that's that. Uh, it's got nice pocket here. Plenty of little compartments everywhere they're everywhere this is great this fits in i uh, not my 11 inch ipad and my laptop my 11 inch i uh, uh macbook air if i want to take that with me got plenty of hooks extremely comfortable bag extremely comfortable bag uh it's got water bottle or tripod holders on the side or granola bars um Tripod, water bottles, whatever you want on here. Let's see if I can find what it is. I don't. I really don't know what this is. I wish I knew. But anyway, it's it's a pretty pretty neat little bag. I mean, again, you can configure it any way you want. Uh, this one is probably going to go with me. It's pretty much never never leave home without that bag. Then let's see what else we got. Sorry, I got crap everywhere here. I'm trying to figure out. This is a, another low pro bag. This is the, again, I wish they put this stuff on here. Uh, it comes with a weather cover, and I wish you couldn't see that. This is one of those sling bags that you can whip over your uh, shoulder and access without putting it down. I don't you really use it. I forgot I had this bag. But I think on this trip, I'm going to take it with me and I'm going to put my drone controller and three batteries in here and my accessories in here. So I'm going to use it strictly for schlepping the drone around. Uh, as you can see, everything is up here. Uh, charging up the drone. Three batteries over there. I have four 100S batteries. I've got my externals, my SSDs up there. Lenses, all this stuff is going to go into some of these bags here. My diaper that belonged to my daughter. Uh, it's about 30, 35 years old. 32 years old now. Sorry, she'll kill me if she hears that I call her 35. But anyway, uh, I've got a couple of those and they make magnificent, magnificent uh, drying cloth from a light sprinkle, rain, or to clean the lens or whatever. Uh, these are not dirty socks. These I use as covers for the for the lenses. These are Under Armour socks, and you know I, I I slip them on my lenses when I travel. It's a little bit extra layer of protection. And if I have if and if I don't have a lens on the body, uh, I these actually fit over the G50 and the 100s ba uh, body. So I'll use them. I'll pack it all up today. Maybe I'll I'll, I'll add to this video. Uh, what else we got here? So drone, two 50-yard batteries. Uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, all my cables here, my cable bag, another bag here. That, that, uh, anyway, that's uh, for now. This is this is the mess that I have to deal with. I'll be uh, uh, putting it all away into some of these bags here, trying to figure out what's gonna go where. Uh, what I'm taking, I probably won't be taking these bags though. I'm probably gonna take my the one for the drone, my backpack. I may take my this this big low pro here, but I'm not sure. I don't know yet. I'm gonna pack them up differently and see see which one I like. I want to take with me. I also have two more downstairs. Another low pro and uh, a, like a leather satchel, which is uh, 
which is my daily carry bag so but anyway i will uh, put that together later i'm hoping i have a meeting at 11 o'clock in about five minutes that i have to take care of uh don't mind the charging mess this is all the charging stations and battery chargers you see here those will uh wind up in my in the back of my van and i'll do a short video on that once that's set up and you can see what i'm talking about here so again you know uh, just to get an idea of what's happening here all right so we will chat later and uh you all take care and have a great day